Hey guys, I'm Sawyer Hartman and you're watching Rock Forever Magazine. Hey guys, it's Tori from Rock Forever Magazine and I am here right now with Sawyer Hartman. Hi guys. How's it going? It's going well. My voice is here and there, but it's, oh. it's still here. Partying a little yeah. too much yesterday, yeah? I just, my voice goes anyway. Like, as long, if I get excited about something, I lose my voice. It's horrible. That's a horrible problem to have, <laughs> especially a playlist where we're just excited the entire time. Yeah, so, exactly. good luck tomorrow as well. Thank you. But well, we are going to start some finish the sentence questions. Okay. Now, the craziest fan encounter happened when? I was followed around Disneyland for 12 hours. Seriously? And they never said hi. <laughs> I really hope the person who did that is watching. Yeah, well, Dang. they didn't even, uh, they just kept posting pictures of me, like updates. They probably thought and they were really sneaky. Hi. Yeah, never said hi. They don't know I read all my tweets. So I saw everyone, I was like. Mm. They probably have no clue that you noticed too. They're yeah, like, oh, I'm not. so sneaky. He has no idea I'm following yeah. him. There you go. <laughs> and now your favorite viral video is? The dramatic prairie dog. The bum, 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 like that one. Oh, You've seen that it? One. I was like, I what are you talking it. about? It now I know. I've seen it like. 500, 600 times, oh, never gets old. That is true, it's a classic for sure. And now, one fun fact fans might not know about you is? I'm a huge nerd. Really, like yeah. what kind of nerdy stuff are Every you Every type, into? I mean, cameras ner camera nerds, I mean, I'm in it, I'm literally like, video games, computers, software, and cameras, I'll nerd out for hours. So Put me in a Best Buy or an Apple store and you'll lose me. So you're perfect for YouTube then, because like cameras everywhere all the yeah. time, right? Yeah, it's great. And now your most used hashtag is? Heartthrobs, which is like I call my fan base. Oh, oh, that's perfect then. Yeah, yeah gotta rep your fans. <laughs> and last one, if you could trade places with any YouTuber for a day, it would be? Tyler Oakley. I just wanna Ooh. see how, I gotta see what it's like to be that fabulous. Absolutely, that is, he is very fabulous, isn't very he? Very fabulous. Now, what were you doing before you started posting videos on YouTube? Did you have like another job or another career path in mind? Yeah, um, I just moved to LA and I was just an auditioning actor. Oh really? Like what kind of stuff were you wanting to do? I wanted to do, I mean, whatever I could book and then through YouTube realize that directing is more my thing. Oh really? Yeah. So do you think you would ever get back into acting even though now you realized directing do you think? I don't think so. I, I just, I had a role in the new film Camp Dakota that just yeah. came out. Um, but I think that's as far as I'd go. Uh, I'll make appearances for friends, oh. but yeah, I don't really, I'm not pursuing a career in it. Yeah, so how did you end up posting videos on YouTube and turning it into your full-time career? Well, I met, uh, I was dating a girl at the time who made YouTube videos, and I met my buddy Shane Dawson and my now roommate Joey Graceffa, and they all just really inspired me. And you have so many subscribers now on YouTube, I'm pretty sure you were saying on What's Trending they had a million now, over a million, it's insane yeah. really. Um, and that makes you very very influential on YouTube. Yes. Um, so how do you hope your videos are gonna impact your fans? I always just try to make sure that if it's a short film, I wanna make sure everyone's entertained. And you know, just like any film, sometimes the messages are good or bad, but they're fictional. Um, if I do like a challenge or a collab, I really, I want people to at least be happy while they're watching it. You know, whether it's through a joke or they take something away from it, I, I like the idea of I'm helping them or making their lives a little happier. That's awesome that you have a little bit of a mission with your videos. Yeah. You know, you're not just making videos for, you know, nothing. Right, exactly. And what is the craziest thing you have done for the sake of a good video? I feel uh, like there's a lot to choose from, isn't there? Yeah, I stacked for one of the shots in my horror film Strangers, the camera guy I had hired, didn't he didn't feel safe getting the shot because we had to stack three camera boxes nine feet high and right. then climb on top of it and stand and it was just wobbly. So I was like, fine, give me the camera and I climbed it. And now looking back, like I see why he didn't want to do it, but we got the shot. Well, anything for a good shot, right? Anything for the shot. I feel like that's the attitude of most directors. Like, yeah. you get what you gotta get. You gotta have it. It's war. You gotta go to war. Exactly. And you have done some cool collaborations on your channel. As we mentioned, Tyler Oakley was a very interesting one. So if you could collaborate with anybody, who would it be and why? Think big. It could be anybody. It doesn't even have to be a YouTuber. Oh, Leonardo oh. DiCaprio. No. If, that would I, be so if I could put him in one of my films, yeah, yeah we'd be good. I'd make cool. Titanic 2. Please, Leonardo DiCaprio, if you're watching this, Sawyer Hartman's ready to collab. Nice to see you. <laughs> and so many people are inspired by you and your channel, and I think you've inspired some of your fans to start their own channels as well and start making videos. Yeah. So what are your top three tips for them? Be persistent. It takes forever. 
Um, and then also make content that you like and don't really, the last one's just, as long as you're making stuff that makes you happy, don't listen to other people. They don't get it and they won't, but then as soon as you have a big audience, they're gonna wanna get it and they're also gonna want you to be like, let me get in one of your videos. So just keep at it. <laughs> Exactly. And you were talking about your directing stuff, and we've seen a lot of YouTubers these days expanding outside of YouTube. Um, so do you see yourself doing more projects outside of YouTube in the future? Yeah, I'm working on it right now. Okay. Um, just been dealing with you know, some, uh, some more traditional networks and studios, uh -huh. and I want to do a feature. Yeah, and can you tell us a little more about your role in Camp Dakota as well? Yeah, um, I, so as you know, Camp Dakota is based around the fact a... Uh, young actor who's the heartthrob of like a Twilight type film um, is just a very hard client and you know that's at the beginning of film and they all go back to camp once they get fired. I'm that a-hole Twilight lead guy. You got the hair for it though. I do have the hair for it. Is that how you got the part? They were just like, hey, you have the hair. Well, I didn't know whether to be insulted or flattered when the brothers Rydell who were directing it called me and they're like, dude, this is, you're the only role for this. No. They're like, you're the only person we can think of. And I was like, okay, I'll do it. <laughs> well, I am glad you did because awesome movie and a great cast as well. Yeah, it was great. Um, well, what are your plans for right after Playlist Live? Any videos in the works that you can tell us about? Um, a company just gave me a helicopter camera and it doesn't come in for two weeks. So... No more climbing on the... So, yeah, right. So I'm going to wait to do my next film for maybe two weeks. Okay. But um, yeah, at the two days after Playlist, I have a collaboration with Zoella. Oh, and then yeah. five days after that, I have one with Marcus Butler. And I'm filming one with Casper tomorrow. Oh, sounds like fun. Exciting. And anybody who wants to follow you on Twitter, Facebook, social networks are a big deal. So. Everything's just Sawyer Hartman. I made so it easy for you. Thank you for making it easy. Yeah. Well, thank you so much for hanging thank out you. as well. It's been awesome. Everybody watching, make sure you check out Sawyer Hartman's videos. He's hilarious. And also subscribe to our channel for more interviews. And I'll see you next time. Bye. Bye guys.